Have you got to the end of your color grading process in DaVinci Resolve and want to turn off the same node across multiple clips? This process works by replacing the selected node across selected clips with an empty node. For this method to work, you have to have the same node structure across all the clips you want to change. By the same node structure, I mean they're the same number of nodes in the same order. If you do not have the same node structure, this will not work and you will have to go in and reorder your node structure or delete the node manually. Before you start this process, make sure you duplicate your timeline as this is a destructive editing process. You will not be able to undo this. To duplicate your timeline, head to File, Save Project As and name it accordingly. Go to the first clip on the timeline with the node you want to remove. In my case, it's node number 10, which has a LUT applied to it. It can be any number of node, as long as the structure is same across all the clips. Right click on the node, click reset node grade. Right click again, click node label and label it empty. We're gonna label it to easily make sure the method has worked correctly after we paste the node reset. After you've done that, head back to the timeline in the color tab, hold down shift and click all the clips you want to change the node on. If you want to select specific clips, hold down command on Mac or control on Windows and click the clips you want. Then head up to color, click on that, scroll down to ripple node changes to selected clips. Click on that and that would apply this deleted empty node to all the clips selected. Then go through and check each clip has the node you selected labeled as empty and there are no little icons here. This shows that you've deleted the node and reset it. To avoid this tomfoolery in the future, follow these steps. Instead of adding nodes that you know you want to change at the end in the individual clip structure, head up to here in the color tab. There's two little gray dots. Click on the right hand one and this opens up the node structure for your whole timeline. Any node you put in here will be applied to every clip on the timeline. This can then be toggled on and off with Command D or Control D on Windows and this will apply to every clip in the timeline. <laughs>